The number of people murdered in Nashville is going up, and as we've mentioned, the toll is especially high for our young people. Yeah, as of today, 35 people aged 25 and under have been killed here so far this year. That is more than double the number from 2014. But people are also showing up in large numbers trying to force change. It happened at a service tonight that was so crowded not everyone could fit through the doors. News Channel 5's Rebecca Slyker was also there. Rebecca. Carrie, Rory, the number of people who showed up goes to show the growing violence is getting people's attention, although it doesn't seem to be stopping. Tonight, hundreds joined voices to ask someone who can for help. Hey, y'all doing? How you doing? Thank you for coming. How you doing? Thank you for coming. Hey, baby. Connie Donnell. Everybody back there okay? Is a gospel host on the radio. Thank you for coming. Mm, you all right? She's been watching the spike in youth violence. Let's go find these preachers. Our children are just in trouble. With horror. You got the family, you got the community, you got the schools, you got the police, you got everybody but nobody's really working together. Connie and Black Police Association President Reggie Miller decided they needed help. Thank you, thank you. Divine intervention. Don't think that I live like here, it ain't gonna fix me. I live up there, it ain't gonna fix me. So at a special Wednesday prayer service, they asked God for direction, and Connie brought a secret weapon. Because today we are declaring war. This is 12-year-old Jalen Hayes. His young voice reaches all the kids in the building, and in case he misses one, an open casket serves as a symbol. Once the child is gone, they're not coming back. One that's terrifyingly real for 34 Nashville families already this year. We can grow up and be what we want to be when we grow up, Lord God. We can succeed and become what we want to be, Lord God, and not be in that casket, Lord God. With more people than could fit in the building, they prayed and sang, hoping their voices together will drift high enough to hear. We're expecting him to give somebody in this city the correct answer. Looking for direction on how to fight a violent foe. Please fight with God. Everything will be okay. In Jesus' name, I pray. That's taking Nashville's children too soon.